Yo, 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 what's up, friendly viewer? I was just working out and uh, my brain got working and I just thought of this concept. Um, I actually thought about this annoying situation where I felt like somebody was like telling me what to do a lot at work and um, I just thought about how it was bad communication because it just set me into a defensive mode. Now, I'm not saying like it was all their fault, like, yeah, I need to be less defensive, but at the same time, there was some communication that needed to be uh, corrected and uh, based on you know what I've learned about communicating properly with people, I just wanted to share a concept about um, you know commanding somebody versus stating a fact and being on the same team as them. Hope you enjoy the video. How to command somebody without coming off as a jerk? Well, the first thing that you want to keep in mind is that you never want to come at somebody as if it's me versus you. So you never want to say like you need to do this in like a command form because if you do that then it's setting up a frame of like it's me versus you and it's going to put the person into defense mode. It's just a natural, natural mechanism in their brain um, that goes off when they think that they have an enemy among them. So <laughs> uh, what you want to do is you want to come from a we frame or you just want to make a statement. So if you make a statement, for example, um, say you're at work and uh, your work colleague like accidentally leaves like a door unlocked that was supposed to remain locked, like some supply closet or something. Instead of saying, you need to shut that, don't do that again, don't leave that open again, okay? Don't leave that open again. Like instead of commanding them like that, um, because what, what that's gonna do is again, it's going to uh, set them into like defense mode because it feels like an attack, it feels like it's you versus them. What you instead wanna do is you want to just make a statement that closet needs to stay locked. That door needs to stay locked. Or you could even go, we need to keep that uh, door locked. Coming from like a team, like we're on the same team perspective. Although that could even be kind of sending like, we need to uh, keep this locked. So really you just want to make a statement as much as you can. Like this needs to stay locked. Uh, another example could be like, say you need somebody to do something. Like you need to you need them to finish some reports by tomorrow or finish a project by tomorrow. Uh, instead of saying like, hey, write that project and have it finished by tomorrow. Although if you say it confidently enough and your relationship is good, that could work. However, um, a better thing to say would be maybe, uh, you know, this needs to be finished by tomorrow. So if you ever find yourself in a, in a place where you feel like you're being too commanding, at work or in any other environment, um, instead of like making it about them, like you need to do this, I'm commanding you to do this, you should instead just say a statement like this needs to happen or this is happening, this needs to get done. 